So the World Cup 1990 was probably the first time I truly fell in love with football, especially on the national team level. And it was England and Italy were the two best teams, I think. I mean, I always thought the finals should have been Italy, England, of course, instead of, well, West Germany and Argentina was pretty epic too, but might have been a little bit biased and I was always hoping for it to be Italy, England. Nevertheless, it was USA 94. So it wasn't a Euros, it was a World Cup that really, that's where my, my love affair with football just hit this, just skyrocketed because that team with Roberto Baggio, Maldini, I mean, it was unbelievable. And every game of that tournament, every time Italy won, all of the kids of the town would literally dive in from one of, depending on where we were watching it, but most of the time we were at a bar right over there. And all the kids would dive in every time Italy would win with all of their clothes on. They'd all dive in, not, not just the kids, a lot of the grown-ups too, would dive in and swim across the whole port, the whole bay, just to, just to celebrate. And on the final, we were playing against Brazil. And as history now tells us, we lost. We lost at penalties with Roberto Baggio actually missing the penalty. It was, it was a painful night and I burst into tears. I cried, I cried like a baby. And, and it was this amazing local fisherman, friend of ours, came running in to the bar screaming, we're second, we came second, we're the second best team in the world, this is amazing. And we all kind of thought, you know what, he's right, we're second, that's not bad. <laughs> and um, so we dived in again and we swam across the whole bay.